Now, the residents of Ugenya in Siaya County are up in arms over the reluctance of their leaders to push for the completion of a vital bridge across River Nzoya, resulting to the collapse of the local economy. According to the residents, the closure of the old River Nzoya bridge, coupled with the stalling of a new an adjacent new bridge, has spelt doom for them, as they have to spend a lot of money on longer routes, while at the same time pay dearly for the cost of goods and services. Alice Diana brings us this story. Residents of Ugenya in Siaya County have threatened to organize protests against their leaders and government institutions, accusing them of destabilizing the local economy. Addressing the press, the residents, led by George Okecho Kumu, blamed local authorities for failing to push for the completion of the bridge across the Nzoya River, saying that the incomplete bridge has led to the collapse of the economy in the area, as trading centers such as Nzoya, Ukwala, Luhano and Rachado economic lifeline depends on the vital bridge. Tumekua na shida hapa wa Nzoya kwa muda ya zaidi ya miaka mitatu. Tangu hii diraja ibomoke na waanze mpia tumekuwa na shida mpaka Zoia market imeanguka kwa sababu magari hazipiti pikipiki zinakuwa na shida wananchi wanakuwa na shida na tumelia tumetembea maofisi zote tukitafuta wa usaidizi na hatujapata usaidizi kwa hivyo tunaambia serikali na viongozi wetu wa siaya hasa mbunge wetu David Omo Chieng tunakuambia ya kwamba tunakupatia mwezi moja ili tuone kama hii draja imetengenezwa na watu wapate kuendelea na biashara yao The residents also lamented that children who depend on the bridge to cross over to schools were at risk as they have to carefully maneuver the old bridge to access their schools Tuko na shida kubwa sana draja hezi pitiki tunaomba serikali asaidie sisi watoto wanazanguka hata kwa maji Sisi kama watu wa Ugenya tulikuwa tunadhani tumefaidika juu tulipata hii kiti ya governor tangu waingie ofisi tumelea hii bridge inatusumbua hatujaona governor yetu hapa ni na ni wa ugenya sasa hii askari ndio wameletewa wamelinda draja sijio hiyo inatusaidia kwa namna gani the locals are now calling on both the national and county governments to join hands and prioritize the completion of the new bridge naomba serikali serikali kuu ikishirikiana na serikali ya county Izingatie mambo ya daraja hii sababu wananchi wa hapa wanaumia sana. Ni sasa daraja kuu kubwa hii imekwama na hatujui ni shughuli gani yenye inaendelea kati ya serikali kuu na serikali ya county. Ugenya member of parliament David Ocheng says that he has been in constant touch with the Ministry of Transport over the matter and was expecting positive results soon noting that the delay to finish up the new bridge was caused by lack of payment of the contractor. He however said that he expects the government to clear the outstanding dues once parliament passes the supplementary budgets. As you are aware when we are doing the tarmacking of the road they are not factored factored in the cost of the bridge. This was done much later and the contract is ready with the bridge is really complete done. What is remaining is for the contractor to be paid money to bring the crane and put up the bridge. I've gone to the warehouse I've seen they are ready to do it. What is lacking is the budget from the means of transport. Alice Diana, Hope TV News Watch.